Bonjour, bienvenue dans Mobility TV et aujourd'hui nous sommes très très honorés de recevoir l'artiste Natacha Merit. Bonjour. Bonjour. Merci, Merci. d'être avec nous dans Mobility TV. C'est là où euh, le côté artiste plonge dans cet univers où on parle de mobilité d'automobile. On va faire l'interview en anglais euh, puisque vous êtes franco-américaine, photographe, artiste, biologiste. Natacha Merit, it's a, it's a pleasure to have you because... Uh, Of course, we all see the terrible images of Ukraine war every day, and you decided to provide something artistic and, of course, human, which is a, it's a story of a van, but maybe you can tell us more about it. Well, it's great to be here. Um, yeah, it's a story about a lot of vans. So we are vans, our first fleet. We got involved in the van business at three days into the war, into the invasion of Ukraine. It was the 28th, and we raised $300,000 within a few days from our partners and friends in Silicon Valley and asked the Ukrainians, what do you need? My Yugoslavian fiancé had suffered through a similar situation, and he said, let's just ask the people what they need. And they said, vans. Really? Mm -hmm. Just vans? More vans. More vans. So there I am with van number 12. Uh, we, we gathered 13 vans in two weeks um, around Lithuania, and I brought them to the border after taking care of the vans. These vans are taking people away from Ukraine? Well, they are doing what they need to do, depending on the war, the day of the war. The war is a dynamic situation. Um, the vans started in the first weeks with evacuations, orphans, children, Uh, mothers, babies, uh, the, the, those who really had no other way to get out. We have uh, relocated 16,000 people to date. And on the way, so they relocate, we relocate them where they want to go, basically, and often Europe, outside. outside Ukraine? In the early days, a lot of Europe, and now within Ukraine. So it's yeah. more relocated. Safer places. Safer places, yeah. yes. Who's driving these So vans? we have a wonderful team of drivers. First of all, we're, um, the par uh, parliamentary um, group, uh, with Zelensky's support, we were able to have easy access to move the vehicles around the country, uh, especially one of our collabor collaborators, Velera Sternichuk. Sternichuk. Oh, the Ukrainians love to make fun of my Ukrainian. It's terrible. Um, so we created a logistical chain with different hubs throughout Ukraine that we seeded slowly with different support. So we have always places to stop, to refuel, and to bring aid as needed. And is it uh, a phenomenon that's growing? What? Like more vans and more vans and more yeah. vans, always more vans? Yes, the vans are spawning more yeah. vans. So the objet petita, the sculpture that I created. So about a month into the war, it became difficult to get more charity more donations. And so as an artist, I had this idea, well, why don't we get one of the first vans back and I'll trade you for two. So you can imagine the Ukrainians have a great sense of humor. They love art. They thought it was the best idea. They picked the van that I had helped give. So I bought it back, gave them two, and now the van is on auction. And when the auction is done on Saturday night, we will be able to spawn many, many more vans. There she is. That's the van. Yeah. And, um, and we're, right now the van is worth $200,000, which puts it at the third most expensive VW van ever sold. You have made a drawing inside, you have decorated it. How, how is it? I didn't touch no. it. All I did was cover it in resin so that we can keep the memory of what it did, Yeah. And which is an amazing rescue vehicle. It's a hero. You decided to, uh, to, to keep this van genuine. Yes, and we preserved all the dusk from Donetsk region where it came from when we could still do evacuations from there. We cannot right now, sadly. And we covered uh, the, the bullet holes with resin so it won't rust. And this van can go on spawning more help forever. It is future-proof van, including the broken windows. And we left the children's toys and the things in the van as I got yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah. How do you decide the price? How did I decide the price? Well, the third, it, well, it's an auction. So the first bid came in at 200,000, which oh, is amazing. Oh, so it's not your idea. It's somebody that well, wanted to put 200,000. Yeah, so that would make dollars, right? Dollars. So that's yeah. the third most expensive. We get to 207, it's the second, and we get to 300 and it's the most expensive vehicle ever 
a VW vehicle. Yeah. I mean, of course, VW. there's there's more. But who knows? You know, maybe your show, maybe the viewers are gonna fall in love with it and make it the most expensive vehicle. Do you want to 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 keep this adventure going? I mean, other vans and to to make it you know grow and to uh, to provide other van to provide other vans. Yes. Well, now to be on to be honest, we are providing ambulances. They're still fans, but ambulances, depending on the auction, mobile hospitals, and we're doing international transport of aid from the US. So there's some boats and <laughs> other things. But hopefully uh, this ends and the war ends and it, our vans will just help with rebuilding. That is the hope. I'm an eternal optimist. Do you have any, uh, uh, any a word from the authorities, from uh, Volodymyr Zelensky? Maybe he has called you? Uh, not on the phone. I, I hope he's too busy to call me. But yeah. we just we have letters of thank you letters that somehow the Ukrainians had time to write us letters from the different offices. So it's uh, they're they're doing great work defending their country. Marvelous idea. Thank you for being with us. And and I'm, I, I get a little bit emotive about that, like everybody who's uh, j'ai un peu d'émotion. Je pense que beaucoup de gens qui ont écouté cette interview sont un peu dans mon état. Voilà, quand oui. uh, l'art rejoint l'humanité, voilà, et c'est ce que vous faites, Natasha. Faut garder Mérite. les émotions. Si on perd nos émotions, on a tout perdu. Exactement. Merci beaucoup okay. d'avoir été avec nous dans Mobility TV. Thank you.